Yo, it's the number one good fella, your boy Dylan Dillinger. You already know, see? The Joint Radio, hanging out right now with DJ Monopoly, Tommy Guns, and of course, J Dollars. You dig it? Can we get dollars? So I go. Dylan says so. Spit hot fire! Fellas. Good fellas, Dylan is in the building. You know him, the infamous, the one and only. Kicking it with the good fellas here, real quick. First of all, yeah. we appreciate you coming through. I, I, you know. First of all, let me say something. And this is what I said off the air too. For anybody who's never been here, this is not a little underground, rare, rare, rare steer shot. Uh huh. This is the real thing. Like you know what I'm yes. saying, they move like a major. They, they, their hospitality is major. We offered them some chicken wings. That's right. Chicken we wings, yo, they got chicken set up. I, I'm yeah. sipping on E M J V S O P. You know what I'm saying? My family is good. My security, my management is good. Everybody good. You dig it? Definitely. And they told me I can't curse, which means that if I can't curse, they moms are all listening. <laughs> you know what I mean? They're respected. Yeah. You understand? From the youth to the elders. So big up to Goodfellas Radio the Joint. I'm here and, I, and I'm yeah. happy to be here. So real, yep, I was about to curse again. <laughs> I'm happy to be here. Don't worry, we have to have this just about 99 times show. It's all good. good yo, first things first, like yo, you got like, yo, you're doing a lot of big things, a yeah. lot of new music circulating. Let everybody know, like, you know, what are you working on right now? You know, it's been a while since, mm -hmm. you know, I guess a lot of people have seen you, you know, from the MTV days. What's going on with you right now? Nothing. Nah, boy. <laughs> <laughs> a whole lot of things, man. A whole uh, lot of things. Like, I, I, this is honestly, on a personal level, I'm going to get uh, personal. On right. a personal level, this is the best time of my life. I've never felt like, you know what I'm saying, I've, being in a better space. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel real good because I have a strong team, because my family is good, because the music that I'm making, I have time to think and, and meditate and, and really hold a vibe and really do what I have to do. So, okay. you know, I don't have a lot of, um, the pressure's on, but I work real good under pressure. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I, I'm thankful for everything that happened in the past because uh -huh. it molded me. It did. Yeah. So, you know, Bad Boy Records, P. Diddy, everybody over there, you know what I'm saying, that whole squad, they helped me, they grew me too. You know what I'm saying, the whole MTV experience, that grew me too. So, you know, mm -hmm. yeah, we yeah, we're ready. So, I, I, got, I, got, I got a question to ask. This is your boy, J. Dollars. Yeah, J. Dollars, what up? I got to ask a question. So, mm -hmm. so how has your life changed mm -hmm. after making the band? Man, did you have random cousins from Mississippi <laughs> that you didn't know about? I still got random cousins <laughs> popping out of that man. Yo, at first of all, everybody from Grenada happens to be my yeah, cousin. Yeah, everybody from Grenada. And you know Grenada is like an island of 100,000 people. Uh -huh. The population is actually 100,000 people. Uh -huh. So you know it's like everybody. It's all of a sudden related. Yep. Yep. Shout out yep. to everybody from Caracu, PM, Grenada, and all of that. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the whole West Indies. But my life changed literally overnight. I remember being on the porch, just rapping and chatting, just hanging out. And 24 hours later, being in front of P. Diddy and being moved. Like, it, like I remember one time, P. Diddy, like, when we walked into the Making a Bad Thing, and after, like, the second audition, I thought that it was going to be another audition I get to go home. After that audition, he stood everybody up and said, listen, from this day on, nobody leaves. Wow. Tell your family, bring your clothes to you. I was out on bail. Keep wow. this in mind. This is real radio. I'm, yeah, right? I'm out on bail and I gotta go back to jail. The next in, in about three weeks, three and a half weeks. Huh. Wow. So I'm looking at Puff like you don't even know <laughs> who you're about to sign. You think? Wow. So you know, like of course life changed, and it was due to the powers of MTV and all that. Why I didn't even go to jail, and it gave me a second chance, and it gave me more provision. So of course there was ups and downs. It was a rocky road. Mm -hmm. You know, I didn't do the best, he didn't do the best or whatever, but it was a great experience, great you know what experience. I'm saying? Yeah. So, yeah. yeah, life changed a lot, like everybody know me, they supposed to. Yeah, I'm sure the love in yeah, the well, streets, I'm, sh I'm sure you're still getting the love in the streets. Well, above, above, more above anything. The only people that hate are anonymous bloggers. Yeah. yeah. Shout out to yeah. anonymous yeah, bloggers. Big up to all the anonymous bloggers that, that sign into to such sites as so on and so on and, and just talk yeah. they, talk they, uh, shh. Okay. You know, but the good thing is, like, even them, they're not hating. Yeah. Because they don't even know you. Yeah. They're not hating personally. You know what I'm saying? They're uh -huh. hating whatever they, they think they yeah. know or whatever. Yeah. It's not, if they don't know, it's an image. Yeah. If they don't image. know you personally, if they didn't sit down and drink, how like, y'all drinking with me, uh -huh. hanging out with me in person, now if y'all disrespect, then this person's like, damn, like, how are you? Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? It's, <laughs> yeah, that's different. But yeah. for somebody to diss you, uh -huh. I say, oh, Dallas corner, Dallas whack. Oh, I wish I heard. I read one time on a site. They said, yo, I wish he would just die. What? Who said that? Wow. No, 
anonymous bloggers. See, and, you, know, and, you know what it is? You it's know? like, um, a lot of people just really have nothing popping in their life. I'm gonna be real with you. They, they have no so It's like, you know, they, they, they see cats doing their thing or whatever, and, you know, it's like the Inquirer magazine newspaper. They always be in the newsstands. Like, it's like, yo, Angelina Jolie's seventh kid. Like, right, you know what I mean? Right, like, it's right, like, right, they just talk about other people to, to, to kind of like validate, I guess, I don't know, like, everybody wants to be somebody now these days. I, I let guess. everybody know, like, what's the new project you're working on, like, you know what I'm saying, like, like, like you know, musically and yeah. 2010 is about to be here, where are you trying to take it, 2010? Well, 2010, you know, 10 symbolizes, like, you know, greatness too, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying, I think that, but not just for me, but for everybody who, who you know, this is, this is your time too, not just for me, uh -huh. you know what I'm saying, not to sound like Pastor Mace or nothing, but yeah. God is good. And if you really like keep yeah. it first and all that, and you really work hard, uh -huh. then 2010 is a year. And if you, even if you messed up and you mash up, you know what I'm saying, and 2009 was bad, this uh -huh. is the time to actually, you know, keep going. Yeah. 2009 was good for me, and 2010 is going to be greatness. Yeah. The first thing that's dropping in January is a free mixtape, mm -hmm. which is called Mr. Spin Out Fire. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I'm changing. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Before I'm too kind. Uh -huh. It's, um, it, 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 you know what I'm saying? I, I changed, I did a few changes musically. You know what I'm saying? But when it comes out, it's fresh. Mm -hmm. It's fresh. You know what I'm saying? So Mr. Spit Hot Fire is dropping January for free. Uh -huh. dope, dope. That's the first thing. Yeah, we got calls already. Calls are coming in. Dot line, you're blowing up the phone lines. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and, uh, so um, what else? And, you got? and I got a video that's out right now called Ego, Big Ego, directed by my boy Mazio. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That is sure. great. We just How finished up a new video called Promise that's dropping sure, at the end of January. Out. And that song is gonna be in rotation. Yazid, you know what I mean, and um, and that video was done, and, and Promise was uh, produced by a good friend of mine and a great producer named Eddie Loco. So, you know, you know what I'm saying. And as far as like team wise, you know what I'm saying. I got my my big brother, big cousin, tip top rolling with me. You know what I'm saying, Mr. Foreman and the family. So, you know. Big up to the whole UK, Dream Team Nation, and you know, all of Brooklyn. Definitely. So you know what? I think we need to get into one of these records real quick. Yeah. This is Goodfellas Radio 99.3 The Joint. Don't, Don't worry, man. ladies, I got you because, yo, big up because you all know I am the girl of fear and be a We father. Speaking of ladies, we got, I, we got a couple ladies who got a couple questions up. for you. When we come back. Oh, of course, of course. When we come back. Yeah. So let's get into this record right here. DJ Monopoly on the ones and twos. This is Goodfellas Radio 99.3 The Joint. The Joint. The world's most dangerous radio show. Let's get it. New music. Yeah, jokes. Facebook just hit us up. Can you say the uh the Twitter page one more time? The Twitter page is at Dylan underscore Dillinger. Okay. Twitter at um D Y L A N underscore D I L I N J A H. Okay. Also, also, we also gotta forgive me for getting your name wrong, love. I think her name is Shima. Shima. She's a. She wants to know how do you still talk to the crew members from making the band? That's a good question. Do you still keep in contact with them? What's her name again? Shyman. Shyman? How do you spell it? C-H-A-I-M-A-A-N. Shyman. Shyman. What else? probably Shyman. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully she's not a she-man, but you know. No Lady Gaga's up in here. That's another show. Yo, big up Lady Gaga. That's a that's a whole nother show right there. Collaboration, but you guys. Yeah, he's trying to get that MTV money. You see what I'm saying? I'm keeping it clean, like, lady guy, don't disrespect me. Nah, but uh, oh, check it out. Um, yes, I actually do. You know what I'm saying? And more, like on Twitter, I've been keeping up with Babs on Twitter. You know what I'm saying? We speak once in a while. We say what's up to each other. Yeah. Chopper. You know what I'm saying? Big up Young City, Chopper City. We speak on Twitter. Ness, I haven't spoke to in forever. Oh, yeah. That's my yeah. boy still, but um, I haven't spoken to him forever. Freddie, I spoke to him on the phone about three months ago, and the same with Sarah Stokes. I spoke okay. to her a few months ago.